guys. This is going to be um, the must-haves. I did just did the one for eyes, and I talked about the Paris one, which meant the Paris palette. But it wasn't just for eyes. Um, I love Sigma products for eyes. But this particular palette <clears throat> is not just eyes. And when we went through a house fire, um, this was like the palette that I use constantly. I did take some other palettes with me, but this is the one that stayed open on my sink in the hotel while we were waiting for our home to be um, basically fixed. <clears throat> excuse me, I am still sick. So, excuse me for all the clearing of my throat, but it will happen many, many times. But this, um, all the beauty gurus on um, YouTube that they used, their name is on the back, so you can see them. And Makeup by Tiffany D is on there, as you can see, and her color is the black color, which is like the Eiffel Tower because it's all sparkle -dies. Let's just look at it. This was a limited edition, but it's still out there on the Sigma website and guys I cannot tell you enough you need to get this one I'm not kidding look at this thing and it's not that big look at it next to my face it's the size of my my face all right I've got to put the brushes which these are real Sigma brushes that's a real contouring brush came with it the other one a short shader E E55 those are good brushes <clears throat> come with it Anyway, I wanted to take those out so that I could hold this. This is not that big because people are like, that's huge. It's like not to take to your hotel or on a vacation. And this is very lightweight because it's made of that cardboard, wax cardboard and magnet. So it stays closed really well on your suitcase. It's very well cushioned, so it was easy for me to throw in my suitcase. And um, it has all these wonderful eyeshadows. And I didn't cover these in my um, must-have eyes because, as you can see, even though you have an array of colors to use, I almost always use more neutrals. There's the, um, I always get backwards. There's the Makeup by Tiffany D one called Eiffel. And you can see it's it's sparkly. Can you see it's sparkly? Like the Eiffel Tower, which really does sparkle like that, you guys. They have the lights on. Um, and then there's Sin for the Sin River, that beautiful navy. Loop, which is more like a teal. A, a deep teal, like a blue teal. Then Dorsey is more like a teal green. Elise, which is one of my favorites. This is what I use in my outer V. Notre Dame, that's my crease color, as you can tell. I've used it the most. Triomphe, uh, that's a, a dark charcoal gray, which you could, again, use as a crease color in outer V. And then the one that I've slapped used up is Versailles, which is a champagne white. It is absolutely gorgeous. <coughs> I can honestly say best ever highlighter color. Here's the great news. Sigma allows you to buy most of these. Definitely the ones that I went to pan on, the Versailles, you can buy them separate as singles. So, so happy. Also, it had two awesome blushes. There's a red tone blush and a peach tone blush. Peche and Rouge. Not complicated. And then Lumiere, which is the highlighter. And again, it comes with a blush bronzer highlighter uh, brush. Comes with it. This is the Paris line. Because it only came with this, I think. <clears throat> but that's just a regular F40 contour brush. And then the E55, but it's the Paris line. Um, oops, upside down. Anyway, uh, you've seen it. It's a short shader brush. It's perfect for these. At, at least for, I used it mostly for Trion. And then I used a blending brush, angled brush for my Versailles. <clears throat> this one has it all. This has face. It has eyes. I would say this is a must-have, guys, and it's limited edition, so I bought two of them. You can tell this is the one that I use the most, and I have another one that I'm saving for when this one runs out. I may even get another one. That's how much I love this. I did go ahead and purchase both Notre Dame and Versailles, and I use the steer out of these brushes and look, uh, blushes, and look how they're not barely used at all. They're highly, highly pigmented products. Good size um, mirror. So it's good to use, you know, obviously ours wasn't a vacation is the reason we were in a hotel. We had a house fire and we had to live in a hotel four months and this baby got me through. I absolutely love the product. Um, I'm trying to think, is there any other product that I didn't talk to you about in the other videos? I know there was one other eye palette that I'm really loving. I don't know if I would say it is a must have, but I'm really loving it. And that I'm keeping it in my purse. Is what? Hello. Where is it? It is. 
Ah, why is it in my purse? I must have took it out. Why did I take it out? Why would I ever take that out? Anyway, it's the new Dior. Um, quad. No, it's not a quad. It's got five colors. What's that? A sink? <laughs> Calta. Anyway. <coughs> um, so, those are the products that I most use on my face. Now, got five minutes. I think what I'm going to do, because the next must-haves is going to be fingernails and... I think it will take the full 10 minutes. So I've been making sure that all these stay 10 minutes or less. So I'm just going to let you go on this one and I'll go ahead and do the nail one next.